502E MYOB Essentials. Create a quote for a customer. I'm going to show you how to create a quote for a customer. So we've already set up that customer. I'm going to click on the Sales tab, then on Quotes. There aren't any quotes at the moment, so I'm going to click on Create Quote. I uh, need to select a customer, so I'm going to type in Flocana Virtual Services. Date of issue is the 30th of September 2017. And I'm going to go to the first line in the item field, type in SPA 962. Quantity is 1. Go to the next line, SPA 932. Quantity is one as well. Go to the third line, SPA 942, and going to quote a quantity of six. Go to the next line, I'm going to type in miscellaneous. Um, we don't have that as an item, so we can add an item on the fly. So, item number is MISC. And the item name is miscellaneous. So sale price, I'm just going to enter zero. And we need to select an account to track sales. So I'm going to use a miscellaneous income account. And then click save. So I'm just going to add to the description. So it's for hardware and cabling. And unit price is $1,490. Go to the next line and I'm just going to type in consulting. We don't have an item, so we're going to add another item on the fly. So item number is consult and name is consulting. Sale price is $1,100. And account to track sales is the consulting income. And the unit of measure, uh, I can choose from quantity of hours, so we're going to keep it as quantity. So this sale price is $1,100 per day. Click save. And just going to change the description. So put add two days on site and change the quantity to 2. So you can see uh, the total of the quote comes to $6,174.90 including GST. So once you're done, click save and that saved your quote.